flights are coming to Pittsburgh International Airport. They're adding a new carrier, Via Airlines, which will serve as four new routes. John Shumway explains how it's going to give travelers more options. New year, new airline. I think that's the way we want to start every January. This time around, Pittsburgh becomes a focus city for VIA Airlines, starting with three direct destinations. We have been really wanting to see Hartford served regularly, and we're excited that VIA understands the importance of that market. Um, Memphis is something that we know is going to work because of the FedEx connection, and Birmingham is new for us. The Memphis flight will continue on to Austin, Texas, with all flights using Embraer 50-seat regional jets. No middle seats here. Allegheny County Chief Executive Rich Fitzgerald says the size of the destination cities is important to business. Particularly to the medium-sized cities which haven't been consistently served by other carriers. While the airport certainly isn't happy about the recent loss of one jet, Casota said it did have a positive impact. It proved the market, which we're very happy about, uh, but it was the wrong management team, right? So now we have an established airline that saw those markets get proved. Hey, let's come in and, and let's pick up where they left off in some sense. And VIA is looking for more. We hope in two, three months to be back having a, a similar announcement with about four more cities that we're looking at. Bowman declined to name those cities. The new flights will have a stripped down base fare of $99 one way. With at most a couple of flights a day, they'll employ 10 people at Pittsburgh International Airport. The airline says you can go ahead and book tickets now, but the service won't begin quite yet. In fact, the first flight will be in April, and that will go to Birmingham. Then Memphis and Austin come in June, and finally the service to Hartford will begin in July. At Pittsburgh International Airport, John Shumway, KDKA News.